Alright, alright, alright. Polo G, step in front of the congregation. Sorry, not even Polo G. Polo G's brother is Hermano. You know what I'm saying? Hermano. No, Hermano. You know what I'm saying? Trench Baby. Now, Trench Baby, I'm not familiar with you. I think I heard a one, two couple songs. But apparently, I seen this shit and I seen this. And it said, Polo G's brother, Trench Baby, faces murder charges after alleged drive by shooting now. And I got some of this information for academics. Now, there was a stream prior to, you know, shout out Big Egg. That he would be talking about, Polo G, the people around you gonna get you fucked up. I never understood it. I just thought like it was some niggas, you know, from the city of Chicago. Maybe it was the, they was doing too much shit. He was trying to bring them up, you know what I'm saying? Show them some love and shit. <sighs> Sorry about that. That little young. Trying to show them some love and shit. And it wasn't working out too well. And I was like, oh, okay. But apparently he might have been talking about his brother. Apparently his brother um has been robbing people. He be hitting people up like cousin Polo G brother. People probably believe him. Like, hey yo, Polo G over here, you wanna go come take some pictures of him? You wanna do a song with him? Woo woo. You wanna uh, shoot a music video for him? They pull up, it's just him with some weapons. I don't know if he got some people's with him, and he robs them, which is crazy. Now the industry been knowing about this because probably people they've been robbing have ties with people. Which I get it, probably you a young uh not even young, but you coming up, you like, oh shit, working with Polo G, this would be great. You know, good luck for me. He looking out, da 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 da. He's his brother, bro, bro, bro. This shit can be trusted, you know what I'm saying? You pop over, bro, over there with some sticks, like, hey, give me everything you got. And it's crazy. And at this point, it's like, why do you gotta do this? Because if you don't know, Polo G's brother, brother, Trench Baby, he's a rapper as well, upcoming rapper. So you're looking at him, bro, you have the tools. Your brother is already a prominent and very successful rapper, in my opinion, doing his thing. Mom's the management. Y'all out of Chicago here, doing your thing. You know what I'm saying? And you was in trenches doing your thing, whatever. That's your type of music you make. And your brother already a rapper. So you probably going to get some premium beats, some good studio time. You know what I'm saying? And if you confuse shit, your brother, you could ask him how that shit go. You probably won't really get jerked around in the industry because number one, your brother's in the industry. And number two, bro, a lot of rappers that probably come up, I don't know Polo G's deal, but he was the first one out of his family to come up. He probably didn't sign the greatest deal. I don't know if he's still in that contract with whatever label he signed to, whatever have you, right? With that being said, you already have a person in your family that has made it and you can get proper money from this person to get you a proper entertainment lawyer to for structuring the contract and seeing if there's some bullshit in there if you don't know this a lot of the time i don't know if it's a music lawyer or or entertainment lawyer whatever have you but yes you have a regular lawyer if you go into some legal shit but as well as you need an entertainment lawyer as in like showbiz and all these contracts you sign because they're familiar with it and all the fucking tomfoolery that happens with that being said hey we need to talk about this and read this article i don't know why you would be trying to do some stuff now with this whole murder situation i don't know if bro was trying to come at you or take your life it was self-defense but clearly he was a little bit too hot at you and if you took something from somebody and they try to do something to you nigga hey you didn't have to do this, so at that point, hey, nigga, every equal action, action has an equal and opposite reaction. So we're going to read this shit and find out exactly what type of time you saw. Besides all that, you already know what it is. You know I'm the kid. You know how I tell my itty bitty flicks. You know what I'm saying? Okay, so good. He sleep with a cut up a throne. You know the nigga on the tongue. Let's talk real quick. Trench Baby. Real name. Taran Tor Bartlett is accused of committing various other uh, crimes around the time of this alleged incident. Polo G's brother, Trench Baby, now faces charges of felony murder for an alleged drive-by shooting on June 10th in Los Angeles. Moreover, authorities recently arrested Trench Baby, I can't say my nigga first name, Bartlett, based on accusations that he took the life of a 20-year-old Deshaun Berry in North Hollywood in a North Hollywood parking lot. Um, according to TMZ Hip Hop, the hip hop police they know all they see are uh, law enforcement uh, uh, attorneys reportedly told the outlet that paramedics pronounced the young man dead at the scene at around 1 30 a.m when they found him with gunshot wounds admits amidst these developments trench baby awaits his feet in a jail cell 
uh, we will see how this court case plays plays out if at all furthermore police also claim that this alleged incident was or preceded various other crimes that polo g brother is accused of reportedly they both engaged in the in these were some behaviors so you saying polo g and his brother was doing this shit or or trendy baby and dude like that got caught up was doing this shit and uh before all that before i continue going on again we don't know this individual my condolences to his family he still lost a loved one, he lost a brother, a son, a friend, you know what I'm saying? A stepper, a member. You lost someone you cared about. So, again, my condolences to them peoples, you know what I'm saying? Now, regardless, let's get back into this. <clears throat> Although not much has developed in the case since an August arrest, for example, Drench Baby also faces charges of first degree residential robbery that suppo supposedly took place on August 15th in the same case with the same man. He also allegedly, uh, uh, dissuaded, dissuaded, how, oh, bro, these are some big ass words, a witness by force or threat around September 10th. When these claims, uh, when these claims around these crimes started to surface, Following police investigation, authorities took custody of Polo Gina's brother in August. Oh, I remember this. Wasn't that somebody's birthday or like it was home or whatever? Or whatever, like, there was like a home invasion. They found them at their Los Angeles home. And Trench Baby in particular has no bail option while in prison. His familial Chicago MC partner, though, seems to have avoided significant jail time here uh, through bail. And doesn't seem uh, initially tied to the murder of Barry. As such, it looks like Baby's lack of bail is specifically for this alleged drive-by shooting. They also face uh, accusations of punching a woman in the face at a Burbank studio altercation, but prosecutors dismiss charges for this due to there not being enough evidence. Meanwhile, this legal trouble might have caused Polo G to delay the release of his next album by a considerable amount. Surely he and his family are quite concerned for a uh, trench baby. Yeah, it's too early to call how this case will pan out. These are pretty hefty accusations and charges and might not be too easy to avoid whether or not they are accurate. Hey, all I got to say, man, is Trench Baby, I don't know why he was doing all that. Listen, your brother is Polo G. Wolo G, Piano G. You did not have to do all that. I don't know why he was in the streets. I don't know if you're trying to earn the stripes. You really had beef with niggas. I don't know what's going on. So basically, they're insinuating that Polo G and Trench Baby could have been doing this crime. But they're saying Polo G had nothing to do with the Barry situation. That's why he got bailed, but his brother didn't. Now, listen, I don't know if bro, she can try to do something to you. I don't know if like, his brother Trench Baby joined the, like, joined the gang out in L.A. When there was beefing with them. But like, I don't know. Apparently, dude, he was beefing with allegedly is from chicago so like i don't, like, I don't know if it was like some shit like that started when it was home god damn my eye bro there's something in my eye god damn it sorry about that sorry about that fucking up there we go now i like how i was saying there's probably i don't know if they had like beef in there like i do this i know I don't know if they had beef. Uh, my problems. I don't know if they had beef in the city or whatever. And it kind of spilled out. I don't really know what happened. But like, trash baby, you didn't have to do this. Unless you was protecting yourself. It was out of self-defense. That's one thing. But if you was just going around, especially if you was going around robbing people for no apparent. Like, you didn't have to do all that shit. I don't know if you were looking for attention. You know, Polo G is now the star of the family. He was looking for attention. I don't know what. He was trying to make your own way. He was trying to earn strength. Like, I don't know and I don't get it, bro. And honestly, bro, out of all places to do this, like, bro, y'all living in, like, Hollywood, like, North Hollywood. Y'all, you living in the burbs. I don't know what you doing. Bro, you cannot rob a nigga and then go back to the burbs. Like, motherfuckers would be like, huh? So, the nigga that rob you, stay in the burbs. Nigga, if I was a police, I'd say, nigga, that's weird. <laughs> Like, what the fuck's going on in the burbs? Like, so that nigga casually robbed you and just went back to the burbs? The fuck? Wait, hey, brother Paul OJ? That nigga been tweaking lately, huh? 
Just go and check it out. <laughs> like, that ass. I don't know, bro. We'll see what happens with this case. He didn't need to be doing this. He should have started focusing on his rap career. Doing his thing. You have all the help you can get. I don't know what, what was going on. I don't... Hey, it's like they say. You can lead us to water. But you can't force his ass to drink. And he's a decent rapper, too. His brother was probably helping him. Probably would have put him on this newer album that he was working on. We probably would have got a Trench Baby feature. You know what I'm saying? But hey, man. We'll just see what happens with this case. Besides all that, man. What do y'all think? Put it in the comments down below. Besides all that, like, subscribe. Hope your boy. I hope your boy grow. You know, I'm the kid and I'm talking about itty bitty fleas. I'm gone. Shalom, Zoom, Peace, Shalom, Shalom, Shalom.